it's the rematch everybody has been waiting for. For the first time since that fateful champion sealing victory by San Beda over Lyceum November. 16 Last year, the Red Lions and Pirates will be facing each other on Tuesday. Since then, Lyceum had taken revenge in the PCCL Championship game last February, but it's still different if they had won in the NCAA. Still undefeated in the regular season since the start of season 93, Lyceum is riding on a 25-game winning streak, and San Beda looks to do the improbable once again. What has changed since then? They're more experienced right now. They already know, last year they already knew the system of Coach Topex. Right now they're just fluid, the system. They gained more experience in the D-League, they won a championship, San Beda coach Boyet Fernandez said after the game. Despite an 18-0 regular season, the team from Intramuros laid an egg in the finals as the Red Lions relied on the heroics of Robert Bullock and finals MVP Donald Tankawa. The 21-time champions know it's a lot more different right now but they hope to rely on that formula they used to topple their opponents. We found a way to beat them last year, so we'll try to find a way to beat them this year. It will be a difficult one, but we'll watch and we'll prepare for next game. Fernandez added that the depth of last year's runner-ups and their top-notch defense have gotten them an immaculate 7-0 record this season. Although the tactician is not guaranteeing anything with the results of the game, Fernandez uttered a promise that will leave viewers wanting for more. It will be an exciting one, we'll just have to be ready. We have much respect for Lyceum, with coach Topex and his coaching staff. We just have to really prepare really well for them. Hopefully, we can give them a really good fight, a good game, so that people may watch it and appreciate it. We're hoping in the end that San Beda end up on top. Hopefully, we'll find a way.